Mile Arena. Boise, Idaho, home of the Broncos. And in the Mountain West tonight, Wyoming pays a visit on Boise State. Five. Great possession there for Degan Hart to knock it loose. Yeah, good help by Najee Smith as well. Shaver penetrates. This is Smith. Oh, that's a three. His jump shot is not pretty. It comes out <laughs> like a globe. What season on the road? On the season, only average 65 points a game on the road. Well below their season average. Oh, that's Abo. Three point distance, but operates so well when he backs into the paint. Just like that. Hunter Thompson got caught in no man's land. Away from it. Come up with a nice jump hook finish. Maldonado got a step and finishes. Boise State has turned themselves into a really good defensive team. Powell steps through and scores. The lefty, the freshman out of Waco, Texas. Nine, Ken Palm analytics on the defensive end of the floor. That's a high degree of difficulty. Shaver with a bucket. Four as well. Kobe Young, Lucas Milner in for Boise State. Dussel gets inside and gets on the score sheet. But a year ago, numbers dipped because of the focus with Graham E.K. They need to see him play well down the stretch. Shaver, another difficult layup. He's now one of four from the field. Shaver's feeling it, and he hammers home a jumper. Welcome back. Exactly right. Defense goes under a pick and roll. In the net, Dussel. Got that one to go. And so Wyoming watching him for this first nine minutes of the game. There's Dussel again. He got that one. Well, that's yeah. another great example. Sorry, Rich, about Hart's fronting him. That's a size advantage for Boise State right there. Dagan Hart takes him to the paint and scores over him. Oh, the patience on the catch. Clock's under 10. Maldonado sees the clock, goes to work, crossing over, dishing. No! Oh! Odin! Rebound. Shaver. Oh, he had a, a spot there. Step back three. Got it. That ankle looks all right there. He got the defense dancing. Create. If he sees his guys, especially Maldonado, getting gassed, Rice nestles that one in. That's a play. That top 48 in the net. And with that, four of their remaining games are against quad one or quad two opportunities. Maldonado, nice spinning bucket. Get isolated in that situation at times, even though it's not normal for a Jeff Linder team, you can go zone. Offensive rebound, Dagenhart. Actually almost had a triple double. Ten points, eight assists, and nine rebounds. <laughs> that one, haven't seen that. And that's a bucket. For Najee Smith off of a bizarre shot that went straight up in the air. <laughs> well, Abo's hoping that it doesn't get counted as a shot attempt, but you're right, Rich. It went about 25 feet straight up in the air. That's the result. The ball had come down by then. With the, the flop rule, you either get a flop or you get a charge, it feels like. Yeah. Dussel stripped to the ball. Rice got a hand. Dagan Hart. This is Rice. Lob pass. Abo misses. Smith doesn't. Well, Dagan Hart and Abo, not sure who that was for, weren't able to convert, but it doesn't matter. Najee Smith cleans up the mess, finishes it with his own two hand slam over the top. Don't go anywhere. Boise State is on a tremendous run here at Extra Mile Arena. But it is what it is. Move on to the next play. That's a really strong move by Brendan Wenzel. Rice getting inside. Dagenhart driving, feeding. Oh, reverse! Oh! Najee Smith. Wow, what a pass from Dagenhart. Rebound, he does a little bit of everything for this Boise State team. And the Broncos are dominant on the boards right now, plus nine. Dagenhart. Execution on the high-low, Smith. Shavers back in. Dagenhart can shoot the three, and he does. His numbers 
<laughs> Smith. He's feeling it. He is. <laughs> Shaver finds Rice. Dagenhart. A three. Again. Perimeter to big ball screen. Ducell is the perimeter not used to guarding it. Dagenhart reads it, reacts, knocks the three. Strong move by Maldonado. I have a player who's not afraid of the big moment. Look at Maldonado, man. This guy is a warrior. At times, it feels like he's out there by himself. Thompson, Shaver, step back on his way. No. And it's knocked out of bounds. But the Broncos, Tyson Dagenhart, Marcus Shaver Jr., they combine for 26. Jeff Linder and the Cowboys are on their heels. And, and of course, Noah Reynolds, their leading scorer, is out for the season. And Graham E.K., the preseason player of the year, out as well. Max Rice with a baseline drive. And the ball. Being solid and not getting blown by at the end of the shot clock, but contesting, making shots go over the top. Dagan Hart spinning. Second foul on Rice. Odin hits a three. He struggled for the field. Played really well. Last three games, all in double figures. He's in both the point of defense and attacks now. Abo. It's been a while since this arena has felt this full. This is just a great league as far as venues. There's no easy road wins in this league. Odin step back three. And then the fact that the bottom has really gotten better from a season ago. That's nice stuff by Wyoming. This is Odin driving, getting to the rim, missed the layup. Powell with the rebound, put back is short, another rebound. Powell with the hook, and it's good. Caden Powell, how about... Wenzel, step back. That's a two, and he hits it. His foot was on the line, but a nice touch. Does so many good things for this team. Now with Maldonado back in, let's see who's handling the ball. Wenzel launches and hits a three. He had a clean look at that. Dagenhardt. Smith. But guess who? Don't have to call a play for him. You don't have Wants the ball. Shoots it. Oh, man. The elbow. Not a problem there, although... Especially the way that Wyoming is locked in defensively. Pressure the ball, coming up with the steals. Shaver, just a reminder that he's still here. Whips it out. Good job by Miller to close out. Wenzel. Smith. Oh, that's Powell, who got it away from Smith. Shaver, kick, Rice, launch. Shaver puts so much pressure on your defense. Shaver. Boy, Smith barged in. Tried the rebound loose, may have fouled. Yeah, last year, four teams. Unfortunately, they weren't able to, to come away with any wins in the NCAA tournament. But, you know, if New Mexico... As Najee Smith gets another course crew finish underneath. If New Mexico can right the ship, you know, they've got an opportunity because they still have five quad one, quad two opportunities. I would not put it past the league to get five in. I think four is certain, barring any collapse. Right? Uh, can you hold serve after eight days off? This is going to be a flop call. Dagan Hart with the left hand. Rice, and it drops. Used every part of the rim on the reverse. Odin, round the screen, and he hits. Remember, no reset on the clock. And a three by Dussel, and it's also in is Sadrak and Ganga. And Barnhart. Gets one in. And Wyoming has cut the lead back down to 12 again. You got to give them a lot of credit. They did not give up. They kept fighting. They kept playing hard. Final seconds. Outmans.
And then with their leader injured as well. It's a gutty effort. Two good friends, Jeff Linder, Leon Rice, and Boise State gets the win. They're at 19 and 6, and now 9 and 3 in the Mountain West. Where does that get them? Well, it may move them up in the net, and it certainly moves them to a second place tie with Nevada in the top. So the Broncos win it. Tied for second in the Mountain West. For Dan Dickow, our entire crew, I'm Rich Waltz. This is a presentation of CBS Sports Network. 24-hour home of CBS Sports. We'll head to San Jose for Utah State, San Jose State after the break.